I went to this little local livestock auction to save one animal's life. The calves came out first. And here's this little baby. He just got pulled from his mom. He ended up being the littlest calf of the whole night. No one bid on him. And so I bid on him for $10. And I literally could carry him out in my arms. It was chilly that night, and so we ended up walking into the house. Colton's dog bed was there, and this little baby calf he ends up going over and laying on Colton's dog bed and he falls asleep right in my kitchen. It was just unbelievable. The next day, he ended up being almost exactly the same size as Colton, my dog, and it was still chilly, so I ended up taking one of Colton's jackets and put it on bucket. And I mean, they literally were the exact same size. Colton connected right with bucket. And in my mind, I didn't know like, oh, should I put my dog with my calf? Because I didn't know if that was a normal thing. I had no experience with that. Mm -hmm. And so I just took a chance and just put them together. And then it was like two peas in a pod. They just walked around together. Then all of a sudden, I saw them starting to run together. And then they were playing together. At one point, I was just like, I'm just going to let this friendship be because they wanted to be together. And it was just the cutest thing in the world. Obviously, Bucket's gonna grow. I mean, he's gonna be a big steer. And it was like, okay, he keeps getting bigger and Colton is not gonna obviously get any bigger. I always supervise them together. But luckily, as Bucket grew, their play didn't change really. And Bucket was very conscious of his size at that point. But now he's over a thousand pounds. As he's getting bigger, he started doing this kneeling down thing. Like it was to get down to her level. And so he would kneel down, butt in the air, and then they would continue to play. It was just the cutest thing by the fact that you felt like he was adjusting to her size. Bucket is no different than Colton from a personality standpoint. It's just like your pet. I can call Bucket in the field and he will come over. And come say hi. Hi, Bucket. It's the best feeling. Oh, my boy. Hi. My dream of having a sanctuary, I made it real. Obviously, Bucket was a huge piece of the puzzle. And now, I'm Little Bucket's Farm Sanctuary, all because of my little guy.